there's this lady. Okay. She was literally getting molly whopped by a police officer on the side of the freeway. And it was in California. She and, mm-hmm. and she was getting, I mean, he literally straddled her. First of all, she's walking down the highway. Okay, that's a danger. We get it. Whatever. Yeah. Um, apparently she has some mental health issues. Okay, I get it. And then, so she's walking. Apparently he stops her. She's a little off, whatever. Um, but nonetheless, she's 51 years old, and he, he like, threw her to the ground, straddled her. So he's on his knees straddling her while she's on the ground, covered up like this. Oh. And he's wailing down punches. I wish I could do it like I want to, but this is I mean, punches. Like that? To, with his fist to her head, her face, everything, her entire upper body. She's literally covered up looking for help, you and know, trying to being, stop the blows. Video tape? Yes. Well, a passerby stopped to videotape it. Because they couldn't believe that they're seeing this woman getting beaten to a pulp by a California highway patrol officer. officer, and she's not resisting. She's not doing anything. First of all, when she's on on the ground, first of all, she's a woman. Uh, We don't know if she's crazy or if she was on anything or anything like that. But once you were able to get in a position to straddle her, officer. Right. um, You had her in your control. You had her in your control. There was no reason right. to, to punch her in the head continuously. And I just don't think that it's fair that, you know, that they get away with stuff like this. You know what I'm saying? It's not yeah. – I understand. I'll be the first to say this. My father was a police officer, right, mm-hmm. Chicago PD, for 20 years to the day he died. And not once would I ever say – that police don't have it hard. There are a mm-hmm. lot of crazy people out there. There are a lot of people who don't have anything to lose that will, you know, kill a police officer or whatever to, to save themselves. There are a lot of people who are just off their rocker in general. So I get it. However, you are a trained professional. There is no way on this green earth you can get me to believe that that 51-year-old woman that you beat down on the side of the highway like cars can't see you, like you invisible, and you wow. think that's okay. I think they just get into such a, a way that they don't even realize that they're being out of their body and overexerting, you know, what they're supposed to be doing. That's, that's not protecting us or serving I, us. But uh, what, all I wanted to say was that um, – you know, like you said, when he had her on the ground straddling her, she posed no threat. So there was no reason for him to continue to pull her with his fist the way he was doing. There was no need for that. None. It's sickening to watch. And I just think it's absolutely deplorable. Oh, my God. The video was recorded along the Santa Monica Freeway last Tuesday during the afternoon rush hour. Oh, shit. In it, 51-year-old grandmother Marlene Pinnock is seen being pulled to the ground and pummeled by an unidentified California highway patrolman. It's unclear what Pinnock was doing walking along the highway at the time. The arrest report stated Pinnock became physically combative, forcing the officer to place the pedestrian under arrest with the help of a plainclothes officer. The report also says Pinnock did not advise of any injuries. The California Highway Patrol says there's no need for an independent investigation. Our internal investigation process is very, very detailed and thorough, and it has credibility throughout the country and throughout the state. But some community activists are calling for a federal investigation. The officer has been placed on administrative assignment. Hey.